Well, well done. You had to fight the conditions and a, and a very strong Barnet team then, but you did it and won the three points excellent at the end. Big three points for us today. You're right, the conditions played a, a massive part in today's game. I think they played a, a real big part for both teams. You know, we was definitely on the back foot in the first 45. And I think, you know, Kevin will say, you know, it was a, it, it, it was a back foot performance on his side for the second half, but I thought the quality that was shown at certain times in the second half were enabled us to win the game and we're pleased. Tough place to come. You know, they're a good team, got some good players. And, you know, the manager did really well here. But I just feel that, you know, I, I just feel that, you know, today was all about sticking in there when you are playing on the back foot like we were in the first half. It was a difficult first half, um, you know, kind of showing for us because the weather was so bad. You know, I don't think, you know, you realise just how bad it was today. The, the wind was so strong, but I thought the quality that we shown, especially with the goal, it was a good goal to score. Absolutely, talk about the quality of the goal because it was, it was an afternoon where you really had to roll the sleeves up really and, and show your grit, but just that moment of quality and you then show the resilience as you had in the first half to defend that one goal lead. Well, we did, yeah, and you know, Will's made a great save at 1 0, um, and I felt that probably highlighted what the day was all about people throwing the bodies on the line. But if you talk about the quality of the goal, you know, we spoke about that in the week, you know, could we, could we isolate the full backs 1v1s, could we produce a, a, you know, a, a final delivery that caused them a problem and, and could a midfield run and make the box and you know we managed to tick all the boxes today with a goal it was a good delivery you know Harrison's got past Clough really well and Berry's you know done what Berry does and you know got us the three points. Greg Taylor returned to action today after a, a few weeks on the sidelines for injury and I guess the tests don't come up t much tougher than that this afternoon. No listen, it was a call that we had to make you know I thought Leon Davis done ex you know exceptionally well for, for the two or three games that he's played. But we felt we needed physicality at the back today, and that's why Greg was chosen. And I thought he came in, he's such a reliable guy, just a guy himself, you know, he's a top, top fella. And we've missed him, you know, we've missed him, we've missed Medi, we've missed a few big players at certain moments of our season this year. So to get them back, and Greg especially today, you know, to pull on the shirt and, and play his full 90 minutes was um, was a big, big plus for us. A way for the support behind that goal as well, because they really willed you towards that goal in the second half, didn't they? They did, yeah, you know, we was, um, you know, it was tucked back by how many travelled today. You know, fantastic following, fantastic following. And, um, you know, it's days like this where you share all the rewards together. So they'll all be travelling back and, you know, be delighted with the performance and, more importantly, the three points. We know what it means to everybody. You know, it means a lot to me, the players, football club and the, uh, 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 and the fans as well. So, no, uh, a huge uh, well done to everybody today. Back-to-back -back wins, a great away performance. I guess that all builds nicely into, into Tuesday's night game against the top of the table side in Doncaster. Yeah, which will pose a different type of problem to the one that we've encountered today. You know, to play against the top of the league is always going to be hard. But we fancy ourselves, you know, we want to take the game to the opposition. We don't want to sit back and kind of be that team that, you know, kind of just plays on the on the counter. We want to be a team that, you know, takes the takes the game to the opposition. And listen, we'll, we'll, we'll arrive on Tuesday night and we'll hopefully put in a performance.